Hi all, welcome to another episode of Let's Play EU4. I'm Lay Owen, we're playing Ethiopia, and we're going for the Prostrogon achievement. I first have to apologize. Uh, I was recording an episode and my computer sort of out of the blue froze and crashed and corrupted the video file I was recording. I can't figure out why. My temps were fine, my GP usage was fine, my everything was fine. So I have no clue why that happened. What you missed was we just finished off the Hejaz War, Hejaz and Marahan War pretty easily. We took the coastal provinces, we are coring those, and uh, we gave three provinces to Warsangali, our vassal. There's one Marahan left. We also started the annexation of Mercuria. And let's see here, what else? Not too much else. Uh, we're trying to find some more allies. That's one issue that we, excuse me, are definitely having. I don't really know who it could be. No one wants to be my ally. Um, we're sort of close there, but not really working. You doesn't like me. The Ottomans don't hate me, but we're far away and weaker than them. The Timurids I was trying to go for, they like me more now. We're actually really close now. Um, I wonder if we like gave them a gift or something? Hmm. Let's actually bring back this guy who's making friends. All right, we'll keep this going. We have it at speed five just because we're waiting for things to finish. Um, we have a diplomat free. Really that close? Really? Right. You unrivaled someone and... Mm. Damn you, Timurids, I was about to... I think I can get that much. I needed the rival of rival enemy of enemy thing. I mean, I have a mission that... No. Damn. That's highly frustrating. Um, so any, okay, let's see here. Naj would be a great ally. We're just... Oh, Naj will be my ally. Are they allied with... Their, their rivals are people I'm fine with. They are allied with people I want to not piss off, so let's offer an alliance there. Okay. We're way over our diplomatic relations, but that's okay. Um, we're going to get rid of one of them, and then Oman... Let's just dissolve this alliance. That's fine. There's no reason to stay with you. And then Yemen. Do we have a fabricate claim that I can do? Yes. So we want to go, go after Yemen. They're allied of Ajaran. That's fine. I'm going to take our admin tech now. We are holding off so we can make sure we record everything. That's nice and done. Um, overextension will take some of this away. We're not going to fully get it away. But there's not that much in terms of rebel activity anyway, so... <laughs> Austria is going crazy, as always. Right, temples. We are continuing to build our temples. We built like four in those 13 minutes that we lost. Um, I love this mission. I've never seen it. Increasing the control of spice. It wants me to have like three spice provinces. And I have... Where's the... There's a trade good map mode somewhere. Where is it? That's not it. Sphere of influence, simple terrain, local autonomy. Good to know. Makes sense. Those are the countries we've taken over. Um, trade goods. So that's a spice there. We only have the one. Actually, no, we have two now. So if we took over Mecca and Adan, we'd get to three. But... That's not going to be for a bit. If we had two already, I might have considered that mission. I think having Naj as an ally is a good thing. We'll just sort of... Truce expired of Azeron. That's good. We'll go after them. If I recall correctly, we beat them up the last time. Which, we're only getting 0.27 for more reps. No, well, it's now just Marahan and Hijaz that we're getting. But five a turn is pretty decent money. 
We're going to keep on adding to it. Um, we can build another ship, right? There's the ship. Good enough. Um, armies, you. Together. Yemen. Ajaron. Yemen is allied of Ajaron. Ajaron, who are you allied with? Yemen. So we can just call in both of you and just go to town. Hopefully take them over, figure out what we're going to do. Maybe even take it and release Yemen and sell. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, we're still one over, but that's okay. Yeah. Naj, we have an alliance with, which we want to keep if at all possible. A little bit of aggressive expansion, but other, otherwise it's fine. There we go. Alright, so we definitely want to take this war. Did we finish coring everything? No, let's finish the cores, then we'll take the war. Let's go up to five. Um, there are no temples that give us plus one or above due to autonomy. We'll probably wait then. Come on, course. Gain more mercantilism. Almost always the answer. One core. And here should be the other two. Good. So, yeah, their unrest is going to be nowhere near as bad. Look at the autonomy, though. That's no good. Um, unrest in general. Just those three spots. All right. So... If we declare war on you, we'll drop the speed. Call in Azure on. Oh. Military access. Cancel military access. So we'll declare war on you. Call in. We have no cost of spelly. Mm. So I have to send 23rd of March. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Getting closer to being done with the annexing of the vessel. Let's see here. Clare War, Azuron. Right. Now let's bring these troops together. Send these guys over here. Our boat should be going back. No. Go over there, maybe? Go there. Go and help. Good job helping. Okay. We can't help our ally. Is Mocha Disho our, our vassal? Yes. So we're just going to feed them that. Okay. Got it. Did Yemen really come over? They did. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's slow down. Well, we figure out what we're doing. Much better king and heir. Awesome. I'm very happy about that. You guys come together over there. We'll siege those three and then go kill that army. Um, attach. Ooh, that required a lot. So we're going to feed Mogadishu as much of this as we can. And you are 89%. Okay. Good. Vassal did it for us. Get all our sieges on. Where are you going? Mora. This is easy enough. It's about what we should have expected. Let's go hang out over there. Yemen and... Yeah, you're in a military alliance. I'm already going to kill you both. <laughs> so Yemen, I think we... So we annex Yemen and then feed province? No, we just cord those. There's no reason to feed them back. Do we just take over Yemen? We may just take over Yemen. Hmm. Okay, I have to figure out where they're going. The Juron dropped off one troop. Okay. work for you. And are they almost fully sieged? They are. 
definitely want to get as much to Mogadishu as possible since they're our vessel. Yes, that's right. Siege. If you're one troop against all of mine, go siege. King of Burgundy has died, which means Burgundy, which I've been doing quite well, is now part of Austria. Mm. Always. It's kind of annoying. So we've got them almost all covered. And we are winning sieges anyway. Good. Alright, so they are fully covered. They are fully covered. Back up to speed four. Wait for some sieges. We have integrated Mercuria, which is awesome. Um, it also probably means that these guys are going to hate me more. Yeah. We are apparently now a great power. Um, we have too many troops. Where are our too many troops? Gained an extra navy. How are we doing with the naval force limit? Um, six of six is fine. Right. You go there. Um, through you. Still two over. It's kind of annoying. I'll just get rid of both of you. That should make us even. Okay. Six to two, two. Good. Good. Lots of conversions we can do, but no bit useful right now. There's a lot of unrest up here. I wasn't expecting that much unrest. But non accepted culture and tolerance. It's kind of going to do both. Okay. Definitely take military tech. That gets us cannons, which I'm excited for. Um. time for temples anymore. We'll build some armories. I think plus 30. And we can build another one. Hmm. It may be time that we just have to start sending a missionary out for the hell of it. Just hate that idea. I want to get to admin tech. Okay, well. We're going to do it. Um... These guys are up to four unrest here. We have all sorts of potential unrest issues now with grabbing Mercuria, which is not necessarily good. <laughs> we will continue to improve relations with you to try to keep on your good side. Two peasant uprisings going like mad. Funge nationalists, 2.1 years, 4.0. can't boost stability right now. We are winning sieges. So where's our highest unrest? Ankobar? That makes sense. We're trying to convert you, aren't we? Where are you? I thought you were over here, but I could be going crazy. Ankobar. There you are. Go here. Start reducing. Yeah. I guess we should look to see um, conversions. Definitely Rutana. Another siege we won. Okay, so Yemen is just completely sieged. Let's get all of you over there. Back. Um, 
Our high on rest again. She's on Jetta. Wow, we're just running through the sieges now. Are they fully sieged as well. You know what? We haven't sieged that. Yeah, well, let's see here. Juron. We'll talk to you first. I can't take that. So if I full annex, let's see what I can sell back. Actually, let's. Give you the Mogadishu. Let's give you the Mogadishu. Let's just give you to Warsan Gali. Let's give you to Mogadishu. Let's do that. Um, She was going to have some rebel issues, but you know. Alright. Diplomacy, super peace. Let's just do all this. Good enough. I don't want you as a vassal. We'll take your money. I don't have enough diplomatic power. I need 405 diplomatic power. Well, that sucks. Guess we're gonna wait a little bit. Because I wanna do that. It's not like we're suffering, so. Um, I'm sure I need to send troops up here, right? You have no unrest. You have 2.6 and 2.6 and 2.6. You go there. Oh, these guys. These guys have a problem. Okay. Let's send you all the way up here. Alright. Good enough. Hey, income from vassals. That's what we like to see. We're definitely going to need to take like a pause in the conquest. Maybe just go after these couple singletons and that's it. Um, yeah, no. Do the armory tricks. Because I want more armories. Yeah, man, no. Give Mogadishu all the things. Oh, we're just waiting for power. We're gonna need power for Yemen anyway, so we might as well speed it up. Good enough. Yeah, it's dropping. Funge nationalists. Jura. Diplomacy, super peace. Alright, so that's good. Now, you. I can't full annex because in two more years I can. Get any more ships. Can't build any more ships. What if I... Alright, this is silly, but let's do it this way. Um, select, get rid of you. Build one singleton cog. There. You guys can go back to protecting trade.
Um, damn. Well, that's the timer. Just took me a while to get. So we've got a little bit of a rebellion that has has risen up. Um, but I think we're going to be able to deal with that relatively quickly. Um, we have enough troops, certainly. Um, we'll move them both there. Actually, no. We'll go there. Um, and we'll wipe those guys out. And we are going to deal with some rebellions for a while. That's, I think, why we need to calm it down. You know. Um, it's maybe... No, we're not going to accumulate money. We need to make some orders, though. Anyway. So, yeah. Good episode. We ex fastly expanded our vassals. Did, did some great stuff there. They're going to love us. We'll get them annexed soon enough. Um, and then, in fact, let's improve relations with both of them while we're waiting for this other war to end. We... Oh. All sorts of rebels. Great. Well, we'll deal with them. You. Come down here. We need all, all of our help. Too, too worried. So yeah, other than that, we'll come on to this episode, and the next L1 will be Dealing with Rebels 101. Thank you guys very much for watching, very much appreciate it, and have a good one. Bye!